Good morning, Grade Fours. Today we are going to be finding out how to share with fractions. So, as you can see, I have got one example at the top of our page. It says find one fifth of 15 marbles. Do you see I've drawn a little bag of my 15 marbles in the bag? Now, let's think carefully. If we've got to find one fifth of the 15 marbles, if we think about the fractions we've already been doing, if we know, we see the denominator, what does the denominator say to us? It says to us that this group or this object has been divided into, that's right, five pieces. So now we're going to be sharing then, we're going to share the 15 marbles, we're going to share them by five. Let's start there and do that first. Okay, so let us put here 15. We're going to divide by 5 because, remember, our denominator is 5. So that's why we're going to divide by 5. And then we're going to see how many marbles there are in one fifth of 15. Right. Now, we know our tables, so when the numbers are so small like this, we just use our tables very nicely like this. All right, so we say 15 divided by 5, and we know what times 5 equals 15? Of course, yes, it's 3. So now we know that the answer to the first one is that one-fifth of 15 marbles is, in fact, 3. And we'll write marbles. Three marbles. There we go. Now we're ready for our second example. Okay, so now we're going to do example number two. Now at example number two, they have asked us to find one quarter of 24 passengers on a bus. So if we are going to try and find one quarter, we need to see, look at our quarter and see what number they've been divided into as a fraction. How many pieces are we going to make? Can you see we're going to make four pieces because we look at our denominator. So that makes it very easy. We're going to then divide by, that's right, by four. So we're going to say 24... Passengers divided by 4. And that then is going to give us, let's think of our tables again. We know that 4 times what is 24? That's right, it's 4 times 6 is 24. So now we know that there will be then in one quarter of the 24 passengers there will be six passengers. So let's just write passengers. So then we know that it's six passengers we're talking about. And then we have answered our question, which was to find one quarter of 24 passengers on a bus. So we shared the passengers into four pieces and we got six. If you look at my a diagram, we could have actually checked it like that. We can divide it into four pieces. Can you see? For those that like to see the thing actually in front of them, can you see that there are my four pieces? I can do that as well. And I can count them one, two, three, four, five, six in each group. You will see there are six passengers. So now I want you to go and do the examples in your lesson and I hope you enjoy them. Do them in the same way. Just not write your number sentence like I've done here. Of course this these one this is a number sentence right over here and then you write the answer. 
And the top one is also, that's your number sentence and the answer. And if you wish to draw a diagram to help you, you may do that as well. But remember to write your number sentence. And have fun now sharing with fractions today.